How to Treat White Grubs in Texas White grubs are the larvae of beetles, such as the June beetle or southern mast chafer. The adults emerge from the soil in the spring to mid and lay eggs. The eggs hatch in about two weeks and the small white grubs feed on grass roots. In Texas, most damage from the white grub occurs from midsummer to early fall. The white grubs are white with three pairs of legs and, as they feed in colonies, can destroy the root systems of your lawn. If you have uneven patches of dying lawn, you could have a white grub infestation. Things you will need Water hose with spray attachment Sprinklers Aerating sandals or turning fork Pesticide Nematodes Hose and or hand health sprayer Chemical treatment Remove a section of the affected lawn 3 to 4 inches across and 4 inches deep and inspect for white grubs to confirm infestation. This should be done about 5 weeks after the beetle flights, usually from mid-June to July, depending on your area of Texas. Water your grass well the day before you plan to treat your lawn. This will improve the insecticide's effectiveness. This also causes the grubs to move toward the surface of the soil and within easier reach of the insecticide. Aerate your grass to break up thatch, the accumulated dead grass roots and leaves that lie between the soil surface and the grass. Apply an insecticide such as chlorpyrifos or imidacloprid, ingredients found in Durstan and Merit brand insecticide. Mix according to package instructions. Water the lawn well, making sure it receives at least half inch of water. This will assure the insecticide reaches the roots of your grass. Apply the water slowly to avoid runoff. Non-chemical treatment Remove a section of the affected lawn 3 to 4 inches across and 4 inches deep and inspect for white grubs to confirm infestation. This should be done about 5 weeks after the beetle flights. In Texas, this will occur in mid-June to July. Purchase nematodes, microscopic worms that feed on Texas turf infesting white grubs. Nematodes can be purchased at local garden stores or garden supply catalogs. Aerate your lawn to break up thatch, the accumulated dead grass roots and leaves that lie between the soil surface and the grass. A well aerated lawn can reduce grub populations by half. Water your lawn well, especially if the ground is dry, the day before you plan to treat your lawn. Apply nematodes per package instructions with either a hand health sprayer or one that fits on the end of your garden hose. Water well to assure the nematodes reach the grass roots. Tips Warnings The Texas AM website has a map of Texas displaying the best time to treat white grubs by region. Nematodes will not eradicate the white grub problem but can reduce the population by up to 50%. Wear a mask if you are sensitive to pesticides or chemicals.